Hey everybody, this is Tate Fugit with you from Spring City, Tennessee. I got my old buddy here, Brad Frazier from Evansville, Tennessee on the banjo. Play with me today, I'm gonna do this song I wrote a while back. It's about a Vietnam veteran from my hometown here in Spring City. He was uh, one of those guys that uh, went to war in the 60s and came home from Vietnam and he never fully recovered, I guess you'd say. And it was before a time when People knew what PTSD was and all that stuff, and uh, it's, uh, it's Vietnam veterans didn't get treated uh, very good at all when they came back. So uh, this song is to honor him, and it's dedicated to all Vietnam veterans out there. Thank you for your service. Hope you enjoy this song, and I want to say thanks for the everybody shared the last song that I did. It went all over the country and into Canada and all over the places I had people shared it. So thank you so much. If you enjoy what I'm doing, please share it because that's the only exposure that I get. So I'm going to try to do this song for you. This is the first take. I hope it, we get it the first time. So hope you enjoy it. <laughs> had a home and just wandered around. Walked down the road wearing an old army coat. Smoking cigarettes, sat at Dunban's smoke. They said he was a crazy, dangerous man. He was a pistol packing tunnel rat in Vietnam. 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 He left his mama and his daddy went with his uncle Sam to Vietnam. Well, he was born up in the mountains on a hillside farm. He never did mean anybody no harm. But he grew up poor and he grew up lean. Played center on the high school football team. But he never got to take his graduation exam. He quit school and joined the army, went to Vietnam, Vietnam. Left his mama and his daddy went with his uncle Sam to Vietnam. He never wore a hat that said Vietnam vet. He never drew one PTSD check. He slept out back of an old garbage dump, living off the game that he could hunt. He sent a lot of souls to meet the great I am. He did three tours of duty in Vietnam, Vietnam. Vietnam. He left his mama and his daddy, went with his uncle Sam to Vietnam. He watched a lot of good men die in vain. He started finding ways to ease his pain. Cost on his mind, it was quite expensive. Fighting and killing their that tail offensive. He spilled a lot of blood over that foreign land. Trying to save some people in Vietnam, Vietnam. His mama and his daddy went with his uncle Sam to Vietnam. Then he came home and had a couple kids. He never could forget all the things that he did. There was hand grenades and bombs exploding inside his head. Friends that he had, they were already dead. He started feeling like the sacrificial lamb. This part of him died in Vietnam, Vietnam. Vietnam. He left his mama and his daddy, went with his uncle Sam to Vietnam. Then one day somebody found him dead. Empty beer bottle laying 
by his head. Not too many gathered there to see him buried at the Chattanooga National Cemetery. He won a lot of battles since that war began, but he lost his mind in Vietnam. Vietnam. Sam, Vietnam. 